Hi, in this video I'll show you how to create segment based on person's location. This technique that I'll show you and how to build the segment is not 100% accurate. People can move to different location and not engage with your emails and the location will be inaccurate. However, it is 80% good, so <laughs> you should use that metrics. Before we continue with the video, I have a short announcement to make. We are growing and we have a few spots available for new clients. And I would like to tell you about our partner program, give $1,000, get $1,000. How does it work? If you know anybody in your network who are e-commerce brand, online retailers, please refer them to us. And if they sign up with us, you will get $1,000 and they will get $1,000 discount toward their credit. Or if you are e-commerce brand and you would like to work with us, we will give you $2,000 towards your first months of the retainer. Just visit flowing.com slash partner and see the details of a partner program. And we have a template there, email template, which you can send it to your friend or somebody you know in e-commerce space. And let's start. So go to your Clavio account, click on create list and segments and create segment and let's do location. I live in New York, so New York. So let's do property about someone and there are a few values. I believe it's state, state region, city, and also zip. Um, but remember, zip code, it will be based only if they purchased something or started the checkout process and did not finish. I would strongly recommend to use something like city, for example. And this is one set of properties that you can use, but there's also geolocation. I believe they use IP to define it. So some was proximate location. So let's do some my personal location was in, let's do, I don't know, 50 miles off and let's do my zip code is 10304. This is my office and country is United States of America. So let's do this one and see how many people are in this segment. So first uh, it's profile property and second is geolocation. And this is the entire article. So this is IP, what I just showed you the second option. And this one profile is based off when they open, but never purchase profile makes his first purchase profile opens. You can read it more about understanding when and how Clive sets profile location. If you want to go in deeper details, but you see there is nobody here. Oh, because I put and not or. So let's remove this one and let's do update and see how many people it looks like already. 1259. So this is how you create those kind of segments. And you can create some kind of dynamic flows. For example, if you have a location of your store, let's say in Staten, on Staten Island in New York, and somebody join your segment, you say, hey, like, it's nice to see you in the area. Like we have a store or, or maybe you don't want to be creepy saying like, hey, nice to see you in your area. Just randomly send an email and say like, hey, we have a store on Staten Island. Would you like to visit us and so forth? I hope it helps. In case you have any additional questions, please let me know. Thank you.